For products and apparel that show off your love of soaps, visit the Soap Hub shop today. General Hospital spoilers from Monday, September 21st, 2020, reveal mother and child moments, father and child moments, a necessary apology, and so much more. You won't want to miss an emotional moment of this new episode. Molly spends the afternoon with Alexis, who is still reeling over her possible diagnosis. Mother and daughter head to the follow-up appointment with Portia. It looks like the news isn't what Alexis wants to hear, as she muses why she thought this could happen to her. Will this push her over the edge? Sonny is barely hanging on himself, but things improve when Ava drops off their daughter Avery. She arrives with Nicholas by her side, and asks if they can talk. The bigger question is whether Nicholas will say anything about one of Mike's other grandchildren, his son Spencer. Later, Nicholas runs into Elizabeth. Jax will also be around, thanks to Jocelyn asking for him, but he wants to know if Carly has told Sonny about Nell. Good to see that he's able to continue making things all about him and his big secret with Sonny's wife. Meanwhile, Jocelyn asks Dev, what's a dance without your best friends? Jason tells Brando that he has a plan, but it will take both of them to pull it off. While it would be nice if they were plotting about ridding the town of Cyrus, chances are it's about Mike's memorial service. Either way, it's a safe bet that Sonny would want to be a part of the planning. Should they really leave him out? Speaking of Cyrus, he asks Lulu to relay a message for him. It must be for Laura, which completely bugs out her daughter. She wants to know what it is with his fascination with her mother. Does she not know Laura's magical spell on less than savory men? She's an investigative reporter. She should look it up. Cyrus seems to be on everyone's mind, even if he's not being discussed. He's certainly managed to come between Curtis and Jordan. Curtis takes his anger out on Jordan, but ends up apologizing to Stella. Will Jordan ever let Curtis in on her many secrets? General Hospital made its debut on April 1st, 1963, and is the second longest running daytime drama in American history, coming second only to Guiding Light. The show exploded into mainstream popularity in the early 1980s due to its wide-reaching appeal. Daytime Emmy winners Jeannie Francis and Anthony Geary appeared on the covers of Newsweek and People magazine, and started a soap opera craze unlike any that the world had ever seen. Originally created by Frank and Doris Hursley, the show is currently helmed by executive producer Frank Valentini, head writer Chris Van Etten, and co-head writer Dan O'Connor. The Corinthos, Quartermain, Baldwin, Collins, Jerome, and Ashford families drive stories in the show's fictional city of Port Charles. General Hospital has won the Daytime Emmy for an outstanding drama series a record 13 times, and is one of four remaining daytime dramas currently on the air. The other three are Days of Our Lives, The Young and the Restless, and The Bold and the Beautiful. General Hospital airs weekdays on ABC. Check your local listings for airtimes. For up-to-the-minute spoilers and news, sign up for our free newsletter.